What I want to explain is something that's a little bit confusing in the manual when you look up the, uh, the TBS Nano Crossfire receiver. So what I'm going to do is, I've got the Crossfire in right here, so what you'll do is you see the light from that receiver right there. Put you down one second. I'm going to plug this guy in. And now you can see it's blinking. Okay. And also you can see that maybe you can see it. There, okay, you can see this button and that together. And if you look, it's yellow. So you just bind it, basically you hit that button. But they don't have complete instructions. So basically it doesn't explain what you do when this happens which is basically, it's got this blue blinking light. So you just hit the button again, and you wait for that blue. And that's going to update the receiver. It's gonna take a little while, and then it'll update it. I'm holding it by my hand, so pardon the little shakiness. Okay, see that? Now it's updated it. But it doesn't really explain that you have to press the blue button in... Okay, now it's bound with it. So, you actually have to press the blue button when you see the blue bu button. Uh, the light turn blue and then it'll start flashing and you just wait all the way through until finally it gets to this point where it's bound with this. And then you can actually go into the Lewis script and I'll show you what I'm going to do with this one. Uh, so to get to Lewis script you hold down menu and then you page one time you press enter. Oh, don't want to rename it. Press enter. Scroll to crossfire. Press enter again. And we want to scroll to that. Okay. So I'm going to go press enter, go to 12 channel, go this. We're going to go crossfire. And then it automatically populates 